What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Quest Text. It's gonna be something a little different. Um, in wake, in the wake of Hurricane Harvey and the devastation it caused Texas, uh, and it's causing the Louisiana uh, state and um, the the utter destruction Hurricane Harvey caused. <sighs> um, I just saw we got another hurricane um, headed. Possibly to the east coast over by me over in Jersey um, And they're saying that this thing by the time it hits us could be a category five will break the record of Harvey and I'm one of those people who I, listen. I, I'm I'm a man of science. All right. I'm a man of science um, I really am uh, I, I like to compute data and um, I like to compare data uh, and that's how I come to the decisions that I make as far as my position scientific, on scientific uh, matters. This is, this is, I don't believe in coincidences. This is something, maybe a higher power trying to tell us that we need to, to change how we do shit. Change what's going on. Because right now, um, I, again, I lived through hard, uh, Sandy and Sandy was bad. But they're saying this is going to break the record. All right. And uh, right now, Hurricane Irma uh, is is it's in the middle of the Atlantic and it doesn't and it has no land mass to block it. And what that does is that means that the hurricane, it can surge off of the water because that's where hurricanes get their energy. It, it, it draws from the ocean and the, and because it has a clear path, it basically can stretch the entire east coast by the time it gets to us and i think it's traveling right now at 100 plus miles an hour um and this is man um i i i, I don't i don't really know man I, I don't really know i'm i'm not a religious person i'm not that type of person but i got to believe that something it, this is this is somebody or something trying to tell us that things need to change because you can't have this destruction of Harvey, right? And then now you're going to have the destruction of Irma. And I think it's going to hit uh, the coast of Puerto Rico or, or, or something like that in a couple of days. And it's just like, oh my God, man, I can't, man. I can't, I can't. It broke my heart to see those people in Texas, man, uh, staying on their rooftops, you know, seeing... The, the people crying, man, they losing their homes and shit like that. And then, you know, I got my son and I got my lady now. And I'm just like, man, man, this shit is, it, it's just, it's too stressful, man. You got to deal with so much. Um, and I, I just want to encourage anybody in the, the, the East Coast area, man, uh, if this happens to be, because right now they're in the phase of it could just hit the Carolina coast or it could hook and do what Sandy did. And basically affect New York on September 11th. What the fuck, man? What the fuck? Um, if anybody on the East Coast, I just want to say to y'all, man, be safe when this whole situation goes down. Uh, if y'all got to leave your homes, leave your fucking homes, man. Don't stay, man. Don't stay. You know, if you if you if you know people who are further inland, do what you got to do. All right. Because. We can't have no more loss of life. It's your boy Quest X.